What is up guys, here I have the Galaxy S23 Ultra here, One UI 6.1, here I will show you how to remove this bar here below, and actually it can be quite annoying, I don't really like it in all the app, it consumes some space of your device, some pixels, and I will show you how to remove it. There will be two different options how to do it, one is for my device, for Galaxy S23 Ultra, uh, on One UI 6.1, maybe not all of you have this firmware, One UI 6.1, and it can be different from Samsung devices. So basically, I will show you the second option that work for any Samsung device, and let's check it out from the first one. So firstly, what you need to do, go to the settings, uh, and after this, uh, you search for display, And here we find navigation bar, let's click on it. Then you have two option buttons or swipe gestures. So if you're using swipe gestures, of course it will be helpful. More options here. And that's called gesture hint. So actually you have two options here for swipe for bottoms or swipe from sides. And in both of those options you have the gesture hint. Show where to swipe up for navigation gesture. You can also swipe left or right across the hands to switch between apps. So just disable it, very simple. Now disappear and you will not have this uh, space consuming bar anymore. This is the simplest way to disable it in case you have this options. But there is another way when you don't have this option and this annoying bar uh, always with you and uh, you don't have possibility to disable it. Then you need to go to Samsung store, this store this is called just store and search for good luck app here. I already pre-installed it. Actually for this app, I will record the separate video. This app actually creates for Galaxy phones to customize your Galaxy experience. So you have so many built-in apps here. It's not an advertisement. I just like it that you can customize your Galaxy device and really refresh your UI design. So let's open this app. Here you have QuickStar. I installed actually for redesign of QuickPanel, but you need to search for an app called Navstar here. As you see, this app allows you to customize the navigation bar icons with stickers, change the background color, uh, actually make it smaller and even fully disable it. Let's install it. It doesn't uh, consume that much space. Okay, done. Then you have enough star here. Start, allow all access here. Then you can turn it on. And here we have this option. Actually, there are many options available for buttons and for swipe gestures. And you can make it transparent, make the navigation bar hint area transparent to, uh, to make the content visible. So you can do it like this and it's also already not consuming any space. Let's go back to Google and let's close it. Okay, as we see here, the space is not consuming anymore. Of course, this is on the top of all the, let's say, apps it will be but it's not consuming space anymore so if you still want to keep it then this is the best option although uh, in case you don't uh, have the option in the settings to gesture hint after you install uh, this app it will be available here so you still can disable it even if you don't have this button now when you install this uh, Navstar app uh, this option will appear so you can Turn it on and disable in the settings, very simple. And here you can set up all the others, gesture, change the background color, for example, make it uh, fully like transparent as well, change any color that you want here. For arrow as well, you can reset it, you can gesture handle. You can design it up to your preferences. You see it can be really small almost transparent, change the colors, and it's really customizable here. This actually left back gesture, okay, this is for this part, make it transparent so it will be really small, 
and all the others can be set it up here if you disable it just move back to normal and of course you will have this bottom gesture hint that can be hidden as well and basically that's pretty much it uh, actually what i wanted to show you how to easily hide this gesture hint using navstar or just in a setting if you have phone like galaxy s23 ultra all right that's actually pretty much it in case you still have some question put it in the comments below put the thumbs up and see you next time